All right. Well, welcome back. Hi, folks. Today we're going to be talking, as we promised, about this year's scorecard. So the biggest announcement, and many of you don't know this because it's a, a new process or a new um, idea for you because uh, we haven't presented it before, but this is a really, really, really short scorecard for us. Mm -hmm. We've had scorecards that were in the four-page range, mm -hmm. um, but this year we really want to finish everything that we started in 2016 and really uh, take some time to breathe, um, internally look at all our systems, and continually improve our um, organization. So we're going to lay off the gas and we're going to um, just focus on a few things that are really critical this year. And the first one is that with our clients, what's critical is that we do maintain people's happiness. And so we're not going to be in a growth mode. In years past, we've grown uh, between 12 and 20% a year. Uh, we're going to take a break and we're just going to focus on the clients that we have. Mm -hmm. No, and ILS will continue to grow mm -hmm. um, because we do have some room for growth. Um, we've hired some new managers and we and we want to make sure that uh, we have financial stability in the ILS department. But in SLS, we're going to just um, maintain the individuals that we have. We may add a few if we lose a few. But for the most part, we're, we're where we're going to be for the whole year, which is brand new to us. It's 20, 20 years. We've pretty much grown every, every year. Every single year. Our average growth rate has been almost 14% a year. This year, if we achieve our goals, our growth rate will be more like 3%. Mm -hmm. So that'll feel like a different organization to us. Mm -hmm. Because we want our customers that we have to be happy. Mm -hmm. So if you remember from last week's vlog, pop quiz, how do you have happy customers? You have the best systems. So our systems metrics are also brief. We only have four of them. We're going to talk about two really quickly. The first one we're going to talk about is foundations. Mm -hmm. So foundations is a three-day training that we offer in our organization once a month. We have what's called Fast Track, which is a state-mandated training. So it takes about four to five hours. We do that weekly, but we have a three-day intensive come in and be trained foundations that happens once a month. We want 85% of, of our new employees within the first 60 days of employment, so that's like two opportunities, to come Come in and get that intensive mm -hmm. training. We think it's that important to our organization. So we're going to make room for it and help even um, employees that have other jobs mm -hmm. get there and get into foundations so that um, they can really know who we're about. Exactly. So that's one metric that we're going to mention. The second one about our systems is our evaluations. Um, it's a truism that people need feedback and they want to know if they're doing a good job. And they also want to know if there's an area that they need to improve because people want to get better. So our goal is that 89% of our life guides and our life coaches will have their evaluations occur on time. And that's actually will be growth for us as an organization. We've been a little uh, deficient in our evaluation communication with folks. So we're really gonna make sure that we provide quality leadership um, and communication to our field staff, 89% mm -hmm. um, of them. There'll be a few that miss that for one reason or another, but that's why it's not 100%. And the last rung is about having happy staff. Yeah. So obviously the first way they tell you that they're happy is they stick around. Absolutely. So we are going to work on our turnover rate. Um, our current turnover rate is 47%, um, which may sound high, but it is actually low for industry standard. We want to make it even lower. We want to bring it down to 42% so that we're just really... Um, focused on having happy staff that stick around. That's important to us. And one of the things that we know that had, that contributes to staff quality and happiness is how many clients they work with. It's good for staff to work with a few different ones, but not seven or eight. And that's been, that's happened in the past as we've dealt with, you know, staff shortages or what have you. So our goal, the metric that we're tracking this year is that by July 31, this is an earlier one, uh, early early count by July 31 92 percent of our life guides and SLS will only work on one caseload I'll work for one case facilitator and with the six to ten clients on that caseload so they might work with two or three still but all with one supervisor so they know who their supervisor is and with one group of clients they can really get some expertise and deep relationships with those folks 
So that's our scorecard for 2017. Um, there, like we said, there will be some other goals and things that come out throughout the year, but that's really where our attention and our focus is. So hopefully you'll join us in making sure these things happen, and we hope you have a wonderful 2017. Bye-bye. Bye. -bye. Bye.